Hello and welcome to NetApp KV TV. In this video, we will learn how to use the volume recovery queue on a ONTAP 9 systems. The volume recovery queue is a feature that allows you to restore deleted volumes on your NetApp storage system. The volume recovery queue is where deleted volumes resides before they are completely removed from the system. When a volume is deleted, it enters to a partially deleted state and remains in the recovery queue for 12 hours by default. To begin with, let's check the existing volumes on the system. Execute the command vol show. So in our example, we have volume named vol1. Now let's check the volume recovery queue. Execute the command as displayed on the screen. Currently, it is empty and there is no any entry in this. Now to demonstrate the volume recovery queue, we will delete the volume vol1 using the command. Execute the command vol show to confirm that the volume is now offline. We can see the vol1 state is offline now. Now let us delete the volume vol1 using the command. Now execute the command vol show to check the volume state. It should be in the deleting state. To determine how long a deleted volume stays in the system, use the command In our case, the retention period is set to 12 hours. Now we execute the command all recovery queue show. To view the volume in the volume recovery queue, so the volume will be retained for 12 hours. Run the command wall show to see the offline volume. You will notice that the volume name now includes a suffix 1026. This is nothing but the DSID. Now if you want to delete the volume within the 12 hours retention period, you can use the command wall recovery. There is a command called purge. This will permanently delete the volume. To recover a volume from the volume recovery queue, use the command. This will restore the volume. Execute the command wall show. You can see the volume is in offline state now. Now execute the command. This will bring the volume back online. You can also rename the required volume to its original name using the appropriate command. We hope you found this video helpful. Thank you for watching and be sure to subscribe to NetApp KB TV for more informative videos.